Thank you. Hey, easy now. Your name? Your name? Just a bum. <laughs> That's good. Great name. And you? I'm a bum. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> We're quits. Where are you heading for? Nowhere. Just traveling. Wilderness ahead. No towns. And beyond that, there's just a lot of desert. I know. Still, must keep going. Hmm. Up to you. But still, if I were you, I wouldn't have come here unless I had business. And urgent business, too. From your looks, you've not eaten for quite a while. You're right. It's been three days. All right. I'll get you something. Drink it. The water's been poisoned. I'll give you your water and your food back. You police? Here to arrest me? Not me. Well, from your looks, mm. I don't think you're any traveling businessman. <laughs> hey, listen. Did I ever harm you in any way? You return good. With evil. You left me a lame horse. I could have died. Because I helped you. After all, if I hadn't given you water, you'd be dead now. Put it out. And why? I hate light. Oh, sorry about that. Uh, well, the reason I like light is that I was born at night. My family had lit all the lamps for me. From that day on, I liked bright lights. And whenever there was no light, I used to cry. Dad didn't like that. <laughs> Put it out. Put it out. Oh! <laughs> 
Admit you're pretty agile. I'm real fast. <laughs> you overpraise me. I was doing my best. We carry on. You'll beat me. <laughs> hey, listen. As fate's thrown us together, I suggest we don't get on. You better leave. Take the horse and go. Huh? Hey, you're a hard man. It's so dark. I couldn't ride. It's obvious. I don't care. You're unreasonable. I'm not really asking for very much. All I want to do is sleep here. And I'll leave at dawn. Who is he? And why wouldn't he tell me his name? Caravan. Hold it. The white. No. Listen, mm -hmm. you better run while there's still time to do it. There's going to be blood spill. Blood spill? Who's blood? Jimmy Ching! Come on out! Come out! I'll bring a helper! A helper? If you're really Chi Ming Sing, I'd be glad to help. I am Chi Ming Sing. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, you're running from an enemy. Hey, it's all right. I'll collect your body for you, and I shall pick out a really nice coffin for you. So if you give me your home address, I'll mail you there. Huh? <laughs> oh. Lying on its back. Damn you! Brother, give me a chance. Let me go. Huh. If we did, then we would be killed. <laughs> You're holding that hammer all wrong. I'll show you. Hello. God damn you. Why you hit me there? Well, now, because I like to. Satisfied. Huh? <laughs>
You let me go. No way. We're taking you back. That's for sure. So give up. I won't. Monsoon, we used to be like brothers. Don't make me kill you. Don't worry. You can't anyway. The leader wants you brought back. If we fail, another group will come. You've no chance. Even if you have help. So give up. <laughs> I like to watch you squirm. Have some more. I fought back. And in any case, seeing you were beaten, I thought I'd help out. <laughs> hey, this is yours. Don't you want it? Don't interfere. <laughs> I only meant well. Hey, why are you so mad? How many men have you killed? I don't know. I've never counted. It's boring. Why did you just kill three more? Just two. You killed a third. Now, look, you're here to arrest me, aren't you? Oh, so you think I'm a government official, a police officer. Well, now, I take exception to that one. I'm offended. Oh? In that case, why do you follow me? Hmm? Ah. Hmm? Tell me. Look, you're too suspicious. I simply wanted to be your friend. But if you don't want me to be, I don't care. I mean, it's much better to have one more friend than one more enemy. Right, all right. We can be friends, then. Thanks a lot. But still, I don't get you. You puzzle me. <laughs> Everything has an end, even including puzzles. Right? <laughs> <laughs> right. See? Hey, the Iron Boatmen, why are they after you? Want to hear my story? Well, why not? Nothing to do. I'm getting bored. Iron Boat is the name of a bandit clan. All they care about is money. The truth is you see home. A particularly vicious man. Ruthless, heartless, evil. He calls his men his eagles. And they're trained as killing weapons. In his mind, a life means nothing. And any man who shows any kindness, he will order them tortured to death. So then, Yu Si Hong's orders are always obeyed. Because disobedience means death, and a painful one. I was an orphan kid. When I was seven, I was sold to the Iron Boat Clan. I followed Yu Si Hong. I killed and looted, and gradually, all my human instincts just disappeared. I can't remember how many kids he started off with. Many of them were killed, tortured, for disobeying orders, or sometimes because they'd failed to make progress. Finally, there was just 13. 13? Hmm. That's right. But still, right now, he only has 12. <laughs> You're right, he has. I must admit, 
You tell a good tale. If you were me, chased by Yu Si Hung, you wouldn't be laughing. You'd be running scared. I can tell you that. But tell me, why'd you leave Yu Si Hung? I'm tired of killing. Is that so? You told me his method of training was to turn you into killing weapons. How does a weapon get to be tired? What's more, you tell me they can think and even betray, too. A weapon can't betray. But he overlooked one small thing. I'm still a man. <laughs> and so you're a man, as well as a bat. <laughs> you! You may not believe I can have feelings. <laughs> but you listen to me. And I'll tell you why. One day, you see Hung summoned us for a meeting. The whole group. We all gathered there. information that a big consignment of ginseng and a very large shipment of go will shortly be passing through Hu Fei Town. And I hear there'll be many guards. There's at least 32. Eagle, I think you know what to do then. What I want? Yes, yes sir. sir. Leader, you want those things? We shall get them for you. Right. No matter what it is, we can get it. That's good. Well, one day, I may well ask for a general. If we're to become more powerful, then we need more money. My only worry is that the guards will greatly outnumber you, and they have a good leader, too, Captain Ta Pao. Leader, you needn't worry. We've done many jobs for you, and never once have we let you down. Hmm. Well, that's what I like to hear. Right! He goes! Prepare to leave! need to bother him. Hmm. I'll handle him. You get after the others. Right! 
That's your name. Yes, and so it's yours too. Right. <laughs> That's quite good. Like so. into bed. been in a coma for three days now. I found you in the forest nearby. You were unconscious. Oh, I'm most grateful. Guess you saved my life. <laughs> That's all right. How did you get hurt? Some enemies ambushed me. I fought them off, and then I escaped. Excuse me. What's your name? Chang Chayen. Oh, 
And yours? Ching Sung Kwai. How do you do? My mother? Uh, hello. My wife? <laughs> and my sister. How do you do? <laughs> now then, make yourself at home. And do whatever you like here. Thanks. And get well. So late and you're not in bed. What's wrong? I was just thinking. I've been so evil, wicked, savage, ruthless, without scruples. I committed many crimes. But now, these past weeks, I've learned so much, and I've met so much kindness here. It's all new. Never known this before. I've also learned how to treasure real human warmth. I know love. For the first time. Listen, I'm a killer, you know. Yes, I know it. But how? Because you have some enemies who tried to kill you. Don't you despise me then? No. Because I know that you won't kill again. But still, you don't know. All that I've done in the past. But that isn't so important. What counts is what you do in future. Future? Right. what you do in future. Leah! What now? Well, it seems you can take your vengeance now. Yenlin? Sir. So you found him. Sir! We've discovered where Wang An is hiding. It's a village near Tai Yun. Wang An, huh? Wang An. I never thought I would find you. You put me in jail for two miserable years. But now is my chance to make you pay for that one. Leah, I'll take some men and bring him back here. Let's go now. Die, dead or alive. Get him. Leah. Leah. Timmy Singh's back. Huh? He's back. Go to back. Go to leader. Go to leader. I'm back. I'm so relieved. I had all the other men trying to find you, and then when they weren't able to find your body, I thought maybe the police had got you. No way. You taught me. Don't be caught sooner done. Mm. Before I'd be captured, I would sooner kill myself. Mm. You know, I swore an oath until you came back that I wouldn't touch a cent of all the loot we have, and I've kept to that promise too. I'm honored, sir. Mm. You lost it. No. Oh, why are you not wearing it then, huh? Peter, as you know, I made every single one of those badges with my own hand. It symbolizes your whole life. And it symbolizes the life of this clan. Leader. And it also symbolizes me. How dare you, huh? 
Sir Tari! Hmm. You deliberately disobeyed me. Leader, you... Leader, I'm sorry. Leader. Out you. Out you. Sir, tell me. Of the four Kyungnam police who arrested me, how many have we killed? Three. And who is the one that's left? The toughest, Wang An. <laughs> the toughest. Well, this time that won't save him. This Kung Fu is good. But we must get him without fail. After all, we've got to keep our leader happy. Hey, listen. After we finish, I'll go see a friend. I won't be too long. Oh, a girl? <laughs> hey, finally got caught, eh? <laughs> I know Wang An is in that house there. Hey! Listen, there's some mistake. There's only one family here, and that's not him. Must be somewhere else. Hey, no mistake. I passed here last month, and saw him come out of that house there. Because I was alone, I left him. Listen! Hold it! Listen, there's a mistake. You're wrong. Listen! Wang An! Wang An! Come on! Hey, hey! Now wait! Listen, you got the wrong man. I know. His name is Chang. He helped me. You don't know. You've never met. But I've met him. He's Wang On. Right. I am Wang On. Huh? You've come to help him? Kill my brother? Oh, ha, 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 So this is your girlfriend, huh? She's not bad. All right? Tell her why you're here. Come on. Don't embarrass him. It isn't fair. In front of his girlfriend. Just get one. Hey, hold it! Hold it. Ha.
told you to chop off his head. I couldn't do it. You saying you got feelings now? Where from? Where from? Who taught you to have feelings? Nina, now listen. Quiet. I have many tortures. One hundred and eighteen. And you know exactly how painful they are. In spite of that, you disobeyed me! I'm sorry. Forgive me. Right. But you're going to have to beat all of the men first. You fail. And I'll have you tortured to death! Leader, <laughs> hide! Brothers, listen! to me out of fear of death. I'm really sorry. No, you're not. Take him. I understand. Ever since that time, you're through with killing, right? But it wasn't just that. There was something else as well. And because of those incidents, I betrayed UC Home. Well, I believe that the main reason was because you fell in love with the girl been someone else, someone you didn't love, you wouldn't be here now. <laughs> well, right ahead is the desert. You can go back. Oh, no. I think the next group will be here soon. Keep running. That's no solution. Hey, look there. They've spotted us. Let's go different ways. Make them split. All right? I'll be more in your debt then. Come on. to be your brothers? Why wouldn't you kill me?
I've looked around, and this seems like a good place to bury your bodies. You agree? You're brilliant. But we fooled you. Can't use your sticks here. They're useless in the trees. That's right. We want you alive to take you back to the leader. Oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> show you something. Those two fellas were pretty tough. What did you use to kill them? Well, can't you see them? Axes. Axes? <laughs> well, of course. The moon rises up behind the mountain. And the wind races along Jade Valley. Hanmen march in rows along Haiteng Road, but some have heads held low, thinking of fallen friends, of those torn in pain, left behind to die, wondering if next time, whether it will be their turn.
My friend, what's come over you? You're so morbid. What brought all this on? <laughs> that verse was written by Li Po Yun. It describes the plight of all men who must fight. It relates to men torn from their homes. But me, I'm worse. I have no home. Well, I know one thing. You're no ordinary bum. I can feel you're full of hatred, right? Right. I'm full of hatred. And I'm looking for a number of my enemies. <laughs> That's so. Well, what a contrast. I'm avoiding my enemies. Yeah. And you're running around chasing yours. Now, look. I wasn't trying to be funny. <laughs> Well, can I help you? You can. You've got your hands full, protecting yourself. <laughs> Tell me, if you did manage to kill Yu Si Hung, would you then rebuild up the gang, be the leader, and get yourself more killers, start afresh? Hmm. No, I wouldn't. I would search the whole country. Find a man. A man? Hmm. I'll find him. I swear I will. I have to die at his hand. Because I owe him a debt of blood. Who is he? Suma Chi's son. Cho Yi Fan. Heard of him? Oh, no. Just who are they? Suma Chi was a well-known official. And the underworld hated him. One time, he managed to foil Yu Si Hung's plans to steal something from the court. So then, Yu Si Hung swore that he'd wipe out Su's whole family. <laughs> Chin, you save your breath because you'll need it to talk to the devil. Lao Chi, she's Su Ma Chin's daughter-in-law. She's married to his eldest son, Cho Yi Fan. I'm going to let you finish her off. I'm not taking my own life. Just let my child be born. Then I don't mind dying. That's great. That Yu Fan isn't here now to be killed. You kill her and his child. Now, G, go ahead. Leader, she's pregnant. Hmm? You really have changed now. One time, you were always the first one to kill, weren't you? But tonight, you haven't done a single killing yet. Oh, I get it. You're still brooding over Wang An's death, huh? No. You're ordered to kill her. Go ahead. Oh, kill her. Right. Well. My husband will avenge my death. <laughs> you kill a pregnant woman. 
我们将军，我们将军的死。That it's me. At least I'll be quick. The others wouldn't. Kill her! <laughs> so you killed her. I had no choice, or I would have died there. And they'd have killed her. You taught you well. Kill or be killed. I wanted to live, just to kill Yu Si Hong. <laughs> By yourself. Can you do it? <laughs> I will. I swear it. I will. Somehow I'll do it. Now look. Besides Yu Si Hong, there's the others too. Lin Si Ming, and Fan Lun as well. And any time now, we're going to meet Tu Yin, Yen Min, Lao Ying, Wan Ta, Mao Chou Ying. Chao Chang, <laughs> and I've heard that in the whole Iron Boat Clan, the finest fighter is Yan Min, and then the next is Eagle Wan Ta. The third is you here, Eagle Chi Min Si. <laughs> you seem to know quite a lot about the clan. Well, I've heard all about you. You're famous, but you can't beat the whole of the clan unless you had my assistance. Now look, you could easily get killed if you tried to help me. We're not kin or even friends. Why should you help me? Why not? You have to die sometime. Well then, at least tell me who you are. I'm just a bum. Poor. Hey.、Okay. All right. All right. Something's gone wrong. The first group's been gone two weeks. The second for ten days. And we've still no news from him yet. Right. Now、hmm. you went north. We know he did. Heading for the desert.、We're、sure of that. If he doubled back, then our lookout would have spotted him. And ambushed him too. So we're quite certain that he's somewhere in the desert. That's for sure. But then, listen. I'm sure he must be dead now. He couldn't handle all those men. Hey, don't sell him short. His kung fu is great, and he's clever as well. That's why the leader admired him so. Hmm. But still, in spite of that, he betrayed the clan. <laughs> I could take him though. <laughs> All right, that's enough. It's obvious we'll have to go. There's a small town, about halfway in the desert. So then, we'll check there first. Silver could buy this place, couldn't it?、Uh, no, sir. This is my business, sir.、Uh, how could I sell it?、Sir? Which is faster, you or rabbit? Oh,、uh, uh, Mister, of course, the rabbit's faster. <laughs> I bet that you could be.、Uh, sir,、uh, please tell us what it is you want, sir. I want you to leave,、uh, sir, as fast as you can,、oh, sir. Or I shall beat both your heads in. Oh, hold it.、Hmm? You forgot your silver.、Mm -hmm. You'll need money on the road. Yeah.、Mm -hmm. And in two weeks, 
Hmm? Come back. I sure. When you do, you'll find some bodies here. Huh? There'll be bodies here? You just dig a hole, bury them. Bury? Oh, sure. Hold it. Leave your clothes behind. What? Mm -hmm. Our clothes? Mm -hmm. Wait, trip! Mm -hmm. So you're going to pose as a waiter. Right. This is the only inn in the whole of the desert. They've got to pass here. And we will be waiting. But still, the next three are pretty smart, though. So what? Even smart men make mistakes. And the smartest ones make the biggest mistakes. Get going. Yes, yes, yes. yes, yes. Hey, what we have to do is get rid of one first. Makes sense. Good, that's good. Three guests, huh? Welcome here. Welcome here. <laughs> sit down. Sit down. Oh, please, uh, sit down. <laughs> this place here, just lately, has uh, had few guests. <laughs> uh, this is to welcome you. <laughs> this one, <laughs> to cheer you up. <laughs> this one's for thirst. <laughs> hey, you. Oh? <laughs> Bring your boss here. Yes, <laughs> I'm the boss here and the waiter. This place only needs one person to run it all. Is there anything I can do for you? Hmm. Provisions for three men for three months. Oh, sure. sure. Wait. Oh. Have you seen two groups of men passing through here recently? Uh, let me think. Uh, hmm. Yes, yes. And, and also there was a one-eyed man. He was real generous. He gave me a dollar as a tip. And <laughs> ow! Oh, ow! Oh, 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 that hurts, sir. That hurts. Oh! Oh. Have you seen oh. a man, age uh, 30, well built, uh, and carrying fighting six? Ah, uh, oh, uh, oh, oh, I, I can't talk, sir. Uh, please, sir, uh, let me go first, sir. Uh, oh, ow! Uh, oh. Well, Doc! Uh, yes, sir. Uh, these other men, they asked about him as well. But when I told them, they wouldn't believe me and went off into the desert. Uh, oh. Believe what? Uh, the man, the man that they wanted. Is working for me in the kitchen. Right now, he's washing dishes. Can't be. He couldn't stand that. Right. He's too proud. What's he like? Oh, oh, he's just a man. About 30, wearing a black robe. Uh, and he's quite a tall fella, too. Uh, but he's lazy, though. Doesn't like work. Oh, yeah, got a problem with his leg. Uh, now, which one? Uh, oh, yeah, the left one. <laughs> Makes him walk like this. It drags it. Like this, like this, like this, like this. It makes him pretty clumsy as well. Enough. Huh? Ah, uh, look. Yeah? Check him out. Right. Well, sir, can I go now? Mm. Go on. I'll get your supplies ready. All right, you sit down. I'll be right back. Now, please. 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 Oh. Get up. Get up. You go, Chun. Why, you? Two won't be so easy. Attack him. No way. 
Now we've got to try and split them up. They're real tough. All right. You stay here, and I'll go on down. You watch for Yenling's brass ring. Just one blow, and you're finished. Coming! <laughs> Your food's coming! <laughs> Your friend's upstairs. He says that my new worker isn't the man that you want. All right. He said he was going to the bathroom. <laughs> so you start. Don't wait, dear friend. The house rule is, the first judge is free of charge to any new guests. My compliments. Cheers. Drink up. <laughs> Cheers. Where's the bathroom? Oh, behind the kitchen. Now, go and see. Behind the kitchen. Chopper, it isn't bad. Pass it. How much he pay you for this? But I'm not a killer. What are you? Pig butcher. Huh? Ah! <laughs> Escape from the leader. Won't try to. Because I'm going to him. Hey, listen. Let's cut out the talking. Serves no point. All it does is waste time. <laughs> Clan's place, and you see Hung's fighting skills are the best. Also, he'll have some very good men helping him. So it's going to be a risky business indeed. So I think I should leave. It's safe. Is that right? Yeah. And you? You scared? Sure. No one wants to die. But it depends on what you die for. You know, I've done many evil things. 
and I don't mind atoning for them with my life. Naturally, I would prefer to live. But if I die, it would be worthwhile. You've helped me enough so far, and I don't want to bring you more trouble. I don't want to cause your death. Listen. Foes may help you. And friends may be a foe. What do you mean? Don't worry. What I meant was that nothing's firm. You could say that it's a sort of parable. Maybe your foe is mine too. And while I've helped you, you've helped me. Well, now, our friendship seems complex. <laughs> I guess so. But anyway, it seems to work. I do need you, and you need me. Your foe is Yuzi Hung, and mine is his clan. You have a grudge, then. I want to kill bandits, and who doesn't? I certainly do. Still, that excludes you. We must unite. If we don't, we fail. Remarkable young man. And I guess you killed Yen Lin and all the others. But you've come back, and that does seem incredibly stupid. What have you come for? Now tell me! To kill you! What did you think? Huh? <laughs> and you brought a friend? To be buried with you here. No. I came to bury you. <laughs> Well, we'll soon see. your very worst enemy to help you. But I think he's gonna kill you. For your job. But why have you waited all this time to get revenge? What I wanted was to know what the whole truth was. But I told you this story. You had the chance. Why not kill me? Because I thought we ought to unite to kill our common foe, you see home. Right. You're right. <laughs> you see home. You intended to wipe out my whole family. But I'm afraid. You're not going to answer to me. Well, all right. Get ready to die. Ah! <laughs> 
doesn't seem. That even by combining both of your skills, you'll be able to defeat me. Doubt you. Now you just listen to me. Take my advice and join up with me to kill this man here, Cho Yi Fan. If you don't, then you're gonna die here today. <laughs> Cho Yi Fan, you're very smart. You're using this man to get rid of me. And when you're through, then you'll kill him. My friend, you're trapped here. You must realize that killing me won't be so easy. And even if you did succeed, you're dead. Because Cho will kill you then. He has no choice. He has to avenge his wife. Listen, you help me to get rid of him. <laughs> After all, your fighting sticks are simply no match for his double knives. Stay united. Don't let him fool you. And you'd forgive me? For everything? Sure I would. What's done is done. Got you! I had such great plans for you. You know that I've no children of my own. I'd intended to make you my sole heir for everything I own. Demon Singh. Now listen. If we fight now, he'll gain. Well, I've only your word. You were brought up here. And have you ever once known me to go back on my promise? Leader, do I have your sworn word on this? You do. Do you find? This is the man here who killed your pregnant wife. Take revenge now. Go on. Dog. Friend. Lover. All died for you. You, my friend. I'm sorry. That's how I am. But the main thing is to stay alive. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
You see, Hong, your 20 damn years of torture, they didn't work. Because it's easy to bring someone up, but to win somebody's heart is hard. The heavens have opened up my eyes. I can tell the difference now from right and wrong. Joey Van, go ahead. It's time to avenge your wife, isn't it? My foes are dead. No. I, I swore an oath that I'd die by your hand. And if I hadn't, then the spirit of your wife could never rest in peace. Ah. 